So I'm risking my driver's license right now in this fake matrix to speak to you all about the tsunami and uh, again it's uh, today is the 6th or 5th of September so it's 16, 17, 18 days until the tsunami hits the all the coastline of the entire northern Atlantic okay when this Canary Island it splits into two and I mean at least uh, 500 square kilometers or some shit fall into the sea within a matter of seconds you're gonna see 10 to 30 meter waves at least all around the northern atlantic basin just like the movies all of the predicted programming scripting one thing only the fucking replay of the flood coming here in 2023 September 23 2, 3, 9, 2, 3 It's a mirror! This is why the 2, 3, 9 is so significant Especially for this year Yes, we had the eclipses Of the autumn equinox In 2015 and 17 It was all out on YouTube Again, they changed the algorithm back in uh, In 2016-17 So the search engine got completely fucked over back then before that you had you know lunars like me vlogging giving their five cents and everything entire gatekeeper structure the flat earth leak of early 2015 everything you know now everything is fucked but us the early uh, The early souls. Again, I found out so many, so much fucking incredible shit. I found my twin soul in 2017, but back then I didn't know. I couldn't prove it in the numbers. And I didn't know enough about astrology to prove it in the natural. I can prove everything now. Me and my twin soul's name, it equals to 444 in prime numerology. Just like twin soul. It's 444 in prime numerology. Do you realize what fucking uh, that's the greatest fucking discovery ever made by anyone? 11 11. That's 11 days between our birthdays. I met her. At her workplace she was working in a 7-eleven on track 11 with a train tram station i'm not kidding y'all i even know her past incarnation i know three of my own incarnation i know two of us i know back in the 1700s I was a Swedish poet and she was a very loyal, very stubborn, a very strong woman and a very loyal wife. That's why I live in celibacy ever since she told me to fuck off back in 2017 after we had two months of speaking hours and hours, keeping it clean, keeping it pure, not even holding hands and nothing, nothing, not even insinuating this shit. Even though we knew we were madly in love like this. I had to respect myself and my family as a man in that deep 666 earth, earthly sense. Because I, I'm afraid of violence. I hate violence, but I'm good at it. But I kept worthy in this life. I spared, I turned the other, I turned the other cheek. 